Most children are counting down the days until they can finally open their Christmas presents, but there is one little girl more concerned about what she can give back this festive season. Yes, yeah, seven-year-old Sophia Agate has collected hundreds of gifts for families who've been hit hard by the cost of living crisis this year. And as her family and friends label her a real-life Santa's little helper, Sophia's joined us now with her mum and dad, Kirsty and Ron. That's you on telly there. You see yourself. <laughs> you look at me. Look. <gasps> oh, it's nice to see you. Are you excited about Christmas? Yeah. Yes, I bet you are. Are we allowed to talk about what you might get from Santa Claus? Yeah. Yeah, what's on your list? A bike. <gasps> a bike? Mm. A proper bike? And do you need stabilizers on it? No. Oh. No? Is it a motorbike? No. <laughs> really? You should get a motorbike, you know? I think that's a good idea. No. Oh, OK. Well, we'll think about that one. Yeah, Mummy looks very concerned. Sorry, Mum. <laughs> How are you, folks? You well? Good. Yeah, I'm we're good. Really yeah, looking forward to you. Christmas. Can't wait. Yeah. Good stuff, good stuff. So, Kirsty, I mean, you've been doing some fabulous work, helping all these people, especially in a cost-of-living crisis like this. How did Sophia come up with such an amazing idea? Um, well, it started with, um, she was just a bit concerned about Santa not being able to help out during the uh, lockdown. Um, obviously, we reassured her, he's magic, it'll be OK. Uh, but then now that we're going into sort of cost of living and, and children are sort of understanding a bit as well with sort of what's going on, um, she came up with the idea of wanting to collect presents. So we made you a, a wish list on your Facebook group, didn't we? You're so nice, thinking of others you have all the a time. Facebook group. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh my goodness! <laughs> so tell me, when you first started doing it, what did you do? How did you go about collecting presents? People started like knowing about it, so they started giving presents to us. So we wrapped them up and put them into the donating it's wish cool, list. And how long have you been doing this for now? Um. Three years. Three, Three years. years? And did it start off little? And what's it like now? Massive. <laughs> <laughs> How massive is it now? Like, really big. Like, How bigger massive? than this? <laughs> like, bigger than this whole place. Bigger than this whole place. <laughs> That's really big. That's really, really big. That's huge. Do you know how many people you've helped? Um, 150, I think. 150 people. Look at, look at proud dad there. <laughs> um, what a wonderful quality to have in a child. Just so naturally charitable and caring. It's lovely to see, isn't it? Oh, it's, it is lovely. Yeah, she makes me proud every day. I bet you do. I bet you do. My word. I think she's earned, definitely earned the bike. I think Santa Claus is watching this because he's a big fan of the show. And I think the bike's happening. What do you think? <laughs> and, and, and do you all chip in as a family to help wrap the presents? Uh, do you get your dad Ryan involved as well? Uh, who wrapped the presents? Us. <laughs> <laughs> we did, didn't we? <laughs> you wrote out all the labels for the ages. Well, sometimes. Yeah. <laughs> we got very tired, <laughs> you didn't got you? Bit tired, yeah. And mummy did all the wrapping. Daddy and, put it all in the car. <laughs> and you've helped so many families. I mean, how does that make you feel? Happy. Mm. Oh. Well, I'll tell you what, we've. No, you've been looking after everybody else. So we've got you something special. Can we give you an early Christmas present? Yeah. Do you mind? <laughs> Here we go. <gasps> oh, look, it's a cushion. Oh, what do you say? Oh, no, sorry. I <laughs> <laughs> it's that. It's a little envelope. Do you want to open up that and see what's in there? Maybe Mummy and Daddy can read that to you. You and your family are going to watch Disney on Ice. Disney on Ice. <laughs> <laughs> Look at your little face. Have you always wanted to see that? Yeah. <laughs> <gasps> Amazing. What do you say? Thank you. <laughs> Bless oh. you. Um, oh, well can we done. have a quick word about Sophia's Christmas campaign 2023, that project? Yep. How can people help? How can they get involved? Uh, so we have a Facebook group called Santa Sophia's Collection. And there's a wish list on there that she adds to nearly every day. Uh, so it's just, it's constant. You just buy off of there and it comes direct to our house so that we can wrap them, label them and awesome. send them off. 
And what have the families been saying? Because you've offered such a level of support and it's going directly to them. It's been amazing. There's quite a few families that have kind of come to us at the end of the Even school and, and sort of said, you know, thank you so much. I've had so many hugs in the playground of, <laughs> you know, say thank you to Sophia because our children have now got Christmas presents this year. And it's just such a wonderful feeling that knowing that she's kind of done that for these families. I can it's see you well enough even yeah, talking yeah. about it. <laughs> well, but Ryan... it's, an, it's an incredibly beautiful thing for a yeah. child to do. It's Amazing. I mean, she came out thing. with um, something the other... What was it you said? We should all... Try brighten up the world. That was it. We should all try brighten up the world. And I was just kind of like, oh, OK. <laughs> well, you are absolutely incredible. And thank you for thinking of others. And thank you for helping all those families. And and I hope you have a lovely in. time. Have a yeah. great Christmas. Yeah. Enjoy the bike. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Nailed on the bike. Merry Christmas. Absolutely. Thank you.